Okay, so here we go. Peace. Okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Uh, I am so excited, guys. I mean, I am just so ecstatic right now. Um, I know it's like 1.30 in the morning, almost 2 o'clock in the morning here in Dallas, Texas. And I'm up pretty late, but I was just doing a puzzle and... But I got some really exciting news today, and I've been praying about it, and God has answered. Of course, He always does, but um, I have somebody to watch my kitty, my sick kitty, diabetic kitty. Um, I have somebody to watch him and the whole time I'm gone to Portland, Oregon. I'm going to be gone for three weeks, and coming back in August, leaving July the 11th. And coming back in August and she said that'd be perfect time and she has no problem watching him she's got experience with taking care of a diabetic cat because she has one of her own and so she's gonna try to get him regulated for me and check his sugar and so anyway she's coming by tomorrow and I'm gonna get to meet her and she's gonna check his sugar for me because he will not let me do it I swear he will not let me do it. I'm his mom. Of course he's not going to let his mom do that. No. So he doesn't even like for me to stare at him while he's eating. <laughs> but anyways, he'll let me put his food in his bowl. But anyway, so I'm very excited. It's like a load off of my mind. And now I can think clearly and straight not have to worry about that now I can start thinking about my vacation and getting ready and taking what I need to take uh, you know start kind of putting some things in my suitcase you know um, and you know just a few things that I know I want to take and uh, that I need to put in my suitcase but so I don't forget because I really don't want to wait until the last minute or to the last day that I have to leave to start packing. I want to at least get most of it done. So, and I got enough clothes to do that with. But I'm not going to take that many clothes. I'm going to take maybe three, two pairs of pants and maybe a long skirt and a couple of shirts, a hoodie and panties, of course. Um, and a bra, a couple bras, and that's it, my purse, and my medicine, my medication, and that's it, because I don't need a toothbrush or toothpaste, because we'll buy all that over there, and my mom's got all that stuff over there anyway, so I don't need to take any hygiene stuff, because she's already got it all, and so that would be good. And, um, yeah, so I'm so excited. I get to meet her tomorrow. She's going to come over and meet P meet Piggy and, sh you know, check his sugar for me. And, um, let's see where he's at. And she's going to give me a few pointers. And, um, yeah, and then I'll go over to her house. She's like nine minutes away from me. Then I'm going to go to her house check out her house and you know just see where piggy's gonna be staying and and so um yeah yeah so and i'll have to pack him a little bag and uh take some stuff over there for him um probably have to take his blankie over there so he can lay on his blankie and she said in her backyard she's got plenty of catnip fresh catnip growing from the ground and so in her yard is fenced in so he'll be fine and he will love it if i have if i had a fenced in yard believe me he i would let him outside then because he wouldn't be able to jump that high over a fence he can't hardly jump at all so um I wouldn't worry about him, but I don't have no fence here where I live, 
and it is just way too he can get himself into lots of trouble around here and so I think I feel confident enough where you know he's gonna be okay where he's at she's got two other cats um, she's got some puppies over there she's got a German Shepherd but he normally doesn't he leaves the cats alone normally he tries to play but it never works out for him so I'm not really worried too much she said there's places for him to hide if he wants to hide so but you know she knows how to handle him and um, you know I can call and check up on him and see how he's doing and and talk to him and and uh, yeah so I'm happy and she lives just nine minutes away from me so it's gonna be cool and so anyways how has y'all's day been I hope y'all have had a great and blessed day and hope y'all have a good blessed week coming up and um let's see me and my daughter are gonna go to Six Flags Tuesday and we're gonna have some fun there and I'm gonna try to get uh one of my grandkids uh this weekend keep him uh, before I have to leave um, and uh, yeah that's my plan so anyways if y'all like this video give me a thumbs up S press that subs subscribe button because you won't want to miss any of this um, yeah bipolar life <laughs> but I can say this my moods have been pretty good especially today yesterday was horrible but today it's good thumbs up for that you can give me a thumbs up for that part if you want but hit that subscribe button so you can hear some more um, goofy stuff or random stuff or whatever you never know with me so, I will talk to y'all later, and peace out. Bye.